looks like we're going into Sector 7. This is the last sector before we get to the very end, where we have to fight a rebel flagship. So, um, I think we're going to go ahead and to go into rock-controlled territory, as opposed to rebel-controlled territory, and rock and roll from here. Ha! Rock and roll. Ha! Ah, it's good stuff. Uh, powerful and proud race. Not unheard of to have a peaceful journey, but don't count on it. Cheers. Alright, we got a distress signal immediately. It looks like we can kind of go to the bottom and then make some jumps around there before the rebels catch up to us. So yeah, we'll go ahead and hit up this distress signal. Right now, we just want to focus all our scrap on upgrading. Uh, we're not going to deal with giant spiders. Sorry. Horrible alien spiders are a great way to lose crew members, and I'm right near the end of the game, so I don't want to do that. All right, they've got a rock man. They've got slavers. Let's see. We board the ship and away team. Uh, let's see. You teleport an away team into their hull to attempt to free their prisoners. They're able to get to one person before being caught and forced into a corner by the crew. You quickly beam the team and prisoner back to your ship. Excellent. We got Grozzly here. He's got some damage and excellent shield capabilities. Not as good as Sara's though. Um and kind of pales in comparison to anybody else. So we're gonna we're gonna have to say goodbye to you, Grozzly. Oh well. Thanks for playing. It was a nice attempt. Let's see here. Uh, I think we're gonna do our same dealio there. We're going to go ahead and latch onto the shield system and dodge their first uh, flak cannon barrage because that's what they've got right there. Meanwhile, we're going to board and take out this rock while his teammate hammers on the door ineffectually, and it'll be great. So, we just have to keep an eye on their weapon system and make sure we don't get hit by black. About now is the time we want to do it. Bam, everything misses, shields are looking good, and this boarding party is going to do work! Oh, we're doing excellently. I would have liked that to go a little bit faster, but uh, that's okay. Here comes the flak, but we've got three shields. We're gonna be okay. Yeah, they do a little bit of shield damage, but it's alright. We've just about taken them down. Let's see. Appears the slaves did not survive the fighting. You find their burnt bodies in the hold. <laughs> Before you strip the ship, you hear faint noises in the walls. You break off a latch, and a slave falls out of a hidden compartment, coughing. Wants recompensed. Recomposed, rather. <laughs> recompensed would have made a lot of sense. The slave offers to join your crew. This guy is another rock uh, who's good with weapons and repairs. So that's actually very interesting. Um... I think we're actually going to get rid of Artyom in favor of this guy, and Starger can come work in our weapons room as- ooh, whoops! I uh, need to jump these dudes back before anything else, get them in the med bay. Um, Starger, he's not going to be a good combatant, he hasn't trained in combat unfortunately, though I would like to throw him into the mix. It does seem like he would do very well in our weapons room to help with repairs however, so we're going to go ahead and position him on over there. Sara is doing a rockstar job with the shields. The crew's looking pretty good. Alright. Ready to jump again. Looks like we've got another store we can hit up. Um, I think we'll uh, do a little jockeying around and try and get uh, some cash flow going before we hit this store. In case they've got anything nice. Uh, in this case, I actually want to hold on to my, my drone parts because we're getting to the point in the game where... It's, it's wise to hold on to those. Uh, I will need them for hacking in the final battles, and I, I've got relatively few right now. Shields are taxed as they deflect debris from an asteroid field. As you weave your way between the rocks, you happen upon a rock pirate stronghold. You register teleport signatures and hear shouts aboard the ship. Ugh, wonderful. Also occurs to me I don't have anyone manning the sensors, so I guess we're gonna put him in sensors. Um... And we'll go ahead. They've got a med bay. They've got a lot of shields. We're gonna, we're gonna get ready to deal with these guys the old-fashioned way. Flat cannon. They got a lot of nice stuff going on. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and start draining their shields. Get ready to laser them. Uh, whoops. Uh, that did not go very well. We missed with like everything. But that's okay. We can deal with their shields once and for all. Meanwhile, they'll get bashed in and bloody by the uh, the various and sundry nastiness that's going on in the asteroid field. We might be able to kill this dude before he escapes. Nice, we did end up getting him. We're gonna rush our dudes over. Oh, please don't kill my dude. Okay. We are gonna 
and take a quick five here while we get everyone healed up and systems good to go. Uh, three fuel, no, not good enough. Way too weak of a proposition. Our shields are good, your shields are toast, your weapons are pretty much gone. Uh, that flat cannon is going to be a little bit of a problem, but not that big of a deal. All right, you, sir, get on the rock. Ha, you are the rock. Get on the fire. Uh, in the meantime, we're going to get everybody healed up as they should be. Okay, we took some hull damage there. We got a fair amount of scrap. Things could be better, but uh, they're, they're not so bad. Everyone disperse to your proper station. You work in the sensor room now, sorry. I didn't make that abundantly clear to you. Um, still a little bit low on cash for hitting up the shop, so we'll make a few jumps prior to that. We might do it, uh, let's see. Curious Sight greets you at the, be uh, at the beacon. It's able to rock freighter, drifts in space while two mantis craft battle it out, presumably over who deserves the spoils. We'll wait and then attack the surviving one. Mantis crafts are too busy slaughtering one another to notice you. Eventually the smaller ship gets the upper hand, but they must have blown a fuse in the assault and their weapon system is inoperable. Beautiful. Now is the time to attack indeed. All right. We're gonna... Yeah, we're gonna hack their shields. It's not entirely necessary. We're also gonna power up our shields to three, because I don't know why they weren't. And prepare to deal with these guys. Uh, Mantis men, all up in my junk. And we'll deal with those as we need to. I guess we'll deal with that as well. Hey, you said it was inoperable. Don't, don't you give me that crap. Um, alright. We're gonna go ahead and send you out and sub in your partner here. These guys are dealing with their crap. Um, they don't have many weapons. We, we can cloak when these guys get low in order to secure the kill, probably. Or now, to avoid the next barrage. Bam. Alright. Take our missiles offline. We will get our dudes a healing, and their ship is gone. Alright, that went pretty smoothly. We took a little bit of damage in our weapons room. Um, let's see, the rock must have repaired their FTL and jumped away. Unfortunate, I was hoping to scrap that as well. But, we'll get everybody all healed up and ready to roll. Let's see, Turing and Fleshy are my invaders. Starger, you get your booty back where it belongs. Everybody else start your healing process. Damn. Uh, you can upgrade your med bay uh, so that it heals faster. It's just something I don't really feel like is a worthwhile investment to re power to or anything really. So it's it's kind of to each their own. I don't really like it. You can get alternatives that'll heal you faster than the med bay anyway. So meh. Uh, we'll go ahead and hit up this store and see what they have. Because I've got 170 in my possession. See so if a on Federation frequency. Your Federation? We we weren't sure we'd ever see a friendly face again. There's a little business. Perhaps you'd like to trade. Um, we do have a heal bomb we can pawn off. Let's see what they got. Page two. Uh, reverse ion field is good. And I don't know. I. It wouldn't be a horrible thing to pick up at this point. Um, yeah, I think we'll take that. And if we if we have to pawn it in just a moment, that's fine too. And then we'll keep moving on to the other store and see what we can find there. Um, why do my shields keep going offline? You arrive and detect signs of battle. A few ships are taking passes at each other near a small station. You don't know if it's a territory issue or a contest or a rite of passage. You decide it's best to stay out of it. Sad day. Um... Not connected, unfortunately. All right, that's okay. We'll do the store. We'll do the distress beacon, and I think that's the final sector. Uh, and we'll jump in for the the big battle. You've got absolutely nothing. You're worthless to me. I do not need to repair right now because, or buy fuel, because I'm going into the the last sector. And as soon as you get there, you do get some fuel and a like a 50% repair. So I'll be back up at full. Shape without life forms within uh, a nearby dense asteroid field, giving off a distress call. So we investigate, search it. Uh, hull damage, which sucks for me, but isn't that big of a deal for reasons we have just mentioned. Um, and I guess we'll go ahead and jump to our exit beacon here and get ready for the, the final showdown. Um, no, I don't want fuel. I would sell you fuel, but that's not what you're asking. Alright. Let's... Um, I guess just 
get a crap ton of power going. Uh, and I guess we'll go ahead and swap out our equipment. So we'll get our ion bomb. Leave one laser and we'll get our Vulcan cannon ready to rock. And then we can pawn those if we need to, but we are looking pretty good. Uh, we need to disable... Actually, the basic laser should go last so that it doesn't naturally get powered. Um, bam. 